It began, as always, with the desire for power. The need to conquer. The hunger to consume. Inevitably, this led to conflict. Humanity fought an endless battle against itself. Until it was forced to unite against a power far greater than it had ever known. But even united, humanity left only destruction in its wake. Despite their best efforts at survival, the humans of Sierra continued to march blindly to their imminent doom. Unaware that their misguided attempts at retaliation were only leading them ever closer to extinction. They had thought us crippled by their weapons of mass destruction. But to survive is to endure and prosper. And we have most certainly survived. Jacinto now stands as the last bastion of humanity. A final, desperate defense in the face of impossible odds. In a way, I pity them. But humanity, as always, brought this war upon itself. They're getting bolder. Those gears were guarding Pomeroy Depot. Damn, that's just down the road. Exactly. They're moving deeper every day. At least we got reinforcements. Yeah, but for how much longer? Okay, I'm heading to the hospital now. I need to check on that lead. Thanks, Anya. I... Good luck, all right? Sergeant Phoenix! Are you Sergeant Phoenix? Delta Squad? <laughs> I'm your new trainee. And green as grass by the looks of it. Time to train the Rook? With the attacks at Pomeroy? Hell no, they need me on patrol, not training some jumpy kid. Of course. I'll see you inside. Private Ben Carmine, sir! Reporting for duty, sir! Welcome to Jacinto, Private. Your first order is to guard this spot. You stay here until we get back from patrol. But sir, there's nothing here to guard. Sounds like a good first assignment to me. Stay put. We'll be back, kid. Anya, you still here? Still here, Marcus. Tell Dom I may have a lead on his blind, but it doesn't look... Anya, what'd you find? A lead on a Jango, but it doesn't look like I'll fill you in later, Dom. I have to get back to control. All right, Anya. Good luck. Damn it! Kill these goddamn grubs. Let's move! Looking at Locust Reed. Follow me. Locust got some serious sacks coming in here like this. Doubt it has anything to do with courage. They just don't realize they've been sent on a suicide run. Maybe they're just desperate. What do you mean? 
Maybe the light mass bomb hit him harder than we thought. Or maybe something else is going down in the hollow. I don't know. Heads up, Delta. Some of these patients have rust lung. Okay, take position along these windows. I took the far side. Okay, Delta, I'm back online. We have confirmed Locust presence in the hospital. I repeat, Locusts are in the hospital. Yeah, well now we've got a power outage too. I'm on it. I'll keep you posted. Control out. Hold fire till they're right below us. We want to get as many of them in the courtyard as we can. Most of those supplies are actually fuel tanks, Delta. Part of the ambush. Here they come. Get ready. Control! Where's the power? Almost there, Delta. You got it. The door should be open now. Thanks, Control. Delta out. What'd you say this guy's got? Rust lung. Motion sickness. Cases have been popping up all over since the light mass bomb. There's a horrible way for the warrior to die. Uh, contagious? They say it's not, but I keep my distance. No argument here.
overrun. Grobs are likely to be in the streets around the hospital now, Delta. Get ready.
shit powers out again. Jack, open this door. the glow of locust blood in this light. I've got a sick mind, Ty. The hell are you doing here, Rook? Area I was guarding got too hot, Sergeant. These gears rounded me up to fight, sir. So why aren't you out there fighting? Re reloading, sir. I still don't have that trick down. Better learn fast. Let's get out there, Delta. Grab some cover. We gotta dig in before we can get down there.
Never seen the locusts run like this. Running away won't help! I'll just shoot you in your asses! You are pissed today. Damn right. I missed my family. I'll kill every one of these bastards. Nice work, Delta. And Rook. Carmine. You did good. Well, thanks, Sergeant Phoenix. Control, this is Delta. Enemy threat eliminated. Over. Copy that, Delta. Everything okay on your end? Yeah, it was close. But I got out in time. What'd you find? I... Tell me, Anya. Don't bullshit me. The Jane Doe I mentioned? She fits the description, but... Well, looks like she was released a few days ago. We don't have any info after that. There's gotta be another lead, or... Or something, right? I'm sorry, Dom. That's it. I'm sorry. Damn it! Not again! I've lost her again! Ah! God damn it! Copy that, Anya. Delta out. Dom, you okay? Just... I'll catch up with you in a sec, Marcus. All right? Yeah. Whatever you need. Guys, let's go. <sighs> Not again. Humans are no strangers to war. After all, we've been fighting for as long as we can remember. War is all we know. In the past, we fought for emulsion. We fought for country. We fought for freedom. But all that changed after E-Day. For 15 years, We've been fighting for our very survival against inhuman, genocidal monsters. But it is a fight. We cannot continue. Humanity faces extinction unless we end this war now. So why land down, Sergeant? Why not just drill down here? Jacinto's the one place it can't dig through, and land down's a perfect spot to hit him on their own turf. Heard there's a shitload of grubs there, Sergeant. More like ten shitloads. We had hoped the light mass bombing would decimate the Locust Horde. But they survived, and have returned stronger than ever. They brought with them a force that can sink entire cities. Even Jacinto, our last beacon of hope through all these dark days, is now at risk. Soon we'll have nothing left to defend. And that means we have only one option. Attack. What I ask of you now is not an easy thing, but it is necessary. If we are to survive, if we are to live long enough to see the seasons pass, our children grow and experience a time of peace that we have never known, we must now take this fight to the Locust. We will go to where they live, and where they breed, and we will destroy them! This is the day we take the battle to the heart of the enemy. This is the day that we correct the course of human history! This is the day we ensure our survival as a species! of the cog, my fellow gears, go forth and bring back the hope of humanity! Oi, welcome to the big socks, 
hit the road? You know it. Well, let's go chunk some bullets at them grubs. Group 6, 
Nearing your position. Control out. <clears throat> down here. Delta, control here. I'm detecting serious seismic activity beneath you.
We gotta get closer! together again, huh, Marcus? Looks that way. Welcome back to Delta, Ty. Sorry about your squad. Everything happens for a reason. What the hell happened to Lola? My rig? Uh, we hit some mines. Tickers, I think. The whole area is infested. Okay, Delta, head to the monument in the center of town. That's going to be your best place to drill. Wilco Control, 
Delta out. You heard her, Dizzy. We'll walk you there. Things. Tickers. Locusts use them like landmines. So keep your distance. I'm telling you, y'all gotta clear the way so Betty can move on through. Tickers are ugly, and Betty don't like ugly. Keep moving.
Keep moving, Delta. Cole, we'll see you on the other side. Keep going, baby! <laughs> Control, how much farther to the drill zone? Close. Just beyond the tunnel ahead. Remember, your grind lifts are calibrated to dig from the exact location of the town central monument. You're gonna have to back in the trucks to get them properly aligned. Wilco, Delta out. Could be anything in here. Keep an eye out, Delta. You ever wonder why they don't just give us flashlights? Kid's got a point. Might versus light. Meaning... That I'd take an extra gun over a flashlight any day. Damn! It's darker than a rat's ass in here! Let me light up any kid! Oh yeah! We could use some light! Don't worry! I got your back like a butt crack! 